Hello guys and welcome to Dragon Age Inquisition episode number one. I played this game at Gamescom and I was like, eh, this game is okay, it's not that good, it wasn't that much fun, but I've been hearing all these uh, mega reviews and I was like, I have to play this game, check out for you guys. Um, so if you get enough likes and stuff, enough support in this video, I will do some more. So if you are signing to YouTube, hit the thumbs up button and let's get on with this game. Let's check it out. What the hell just happened there? I was like, what? Right, so we have four different options to go with. I'm not sure which one to go with. So everyone has their own sort of benefits. So like ranged combat, ranged defenses plus 25%. Humans are just like all good all-rounders, I guess. Which is pretty awesome. What's that bonus? Uh, human characters receive a bonus ability point at the start of the game. Okay, that sounds interesting. Uh, the elf. I always like going with elves. I don't know why. I just have a bit of a thing for them, I guess. <laughs> uh, the wolf. So they're good against like... They're not good against, but they've got good uh, magic defense. Because they can't be maidies and stuff. Um, they live underground as well, <laughs> of course. Uh, this guy has a 10% like physical damage resistance. Oh, that's quite useful. Hmm. Also, a bit female as well. Man, the female elf looks awesome. I love his, I love his little, look, these little bits of art as well. They look so good. The female the wolf looks awesome. Man, I'm really tempted to go with her. With her. I don't know why. Um, ooh. I'll go with uh, a the wolf, I think. It's a bit different. I'm going to go with like an elf or a human. Let's go with a dwarf. Dwarf. Right, so dual building. Archer. Two hand. Shield. Weapon. I think weapon and shield is the one I think I'm going to go with. Standard weapon. Dwarf with your shield as well. Uh, I think that sounds pretty awesome. I mean, dual building is quite useful. but I think either the warrior with two handed weapons. Or the weapon and shield. Let's go for weapon and shield. So I'm so indecisive. Also, if you feel like you want you want to skip bits of this, it's completely fine. It is um a bit of customization and stuff in this episode, so I understand completely. I'm gonna go with normal for now because I don't I have a little bit of experience with Dragon Age, but not a whole lot. Aha, so here we go, we've got to pick our guy. Customize his head. Okay. Um, um so we've got to head down. So general face shape. Okay. Interesting. So I can turn him around. Um how do I actually change his face shape though? I start, I'll go select, okay. Face shape. All the different shapes of his head. Alright, um I guess we'll have to go with a beard, won't we, I think. For sure. That's a pretty Go for that shape. I don't really know. I guess so. Uh, skin tone. Oh, hair. This is an important one. Oh, hello. So that's a, bit, that's a bit of a girly haircut, if I'm honest. Um, what sort of hair do we want? There's quite a few girly haircuts. It's weird. It doesn't really dwarf like, does it? That's, that's pretty cool, actually. With like, the beard and stuff as well. Oh, hair color. That's what we want. I want to go for like a dark brown color, perhaps. Oh, white. That actually is pretty cool. <laughs> quite like it. Might look like a brown, though. White, grey, black. There we go. I think that's pretty good. Will that change the eyebrow colours? Can you change the eyebrow colour? That sort of colour, perhaps? Let's go for that colour. Oh, beard. Oh, yes. The famous beards. A little bit moustachey. A bit of stubble as well. Which one do I like? I don't know. Like. Oh, that's a big ass beard. There's so many beards. Quite like that. That one's a bit... I don't, know. I don't know what I like. Let's go with that one still, I think. Oh, voice. What voice? I just hope I can help. That does not sound right. Everything that, you've uh, heard, completely true. So, there's only two voices. How much is this going to cost me exactly? This voice then? This voice sounds like different voices. I don't know why. It's just the same voice though. It's weird. Right, that's done. Um, head and ears. Ear size. Okay. Okay, I can make it like slightly smaller. Make it bigger if I want to. Why do you need to change the ear position anyway? I mean, I guess you can do some crazy customization stuff and make it look crazy. Earlobes. Ooh, important. Uh, cheek shape. I don't go into like too much of it. I want to do like the main stuff if that makes any sense. Uh, the forehead, that's quite important. How big is my forehead? Pretty big. 
Alright, done. Uh, eyes. Ooh, different eyes. Can we do different eye shapes? Okay. Different eye. Ooh, looks slightly upset. Hmm. Slightly like he's wearing mascara. He's got a bit of eyeliner on as well. Right, let's go with that one. Is that the same one? I'm not sure. <laughs> Well, I, I, I size. Ooh. Have big massive eyes. Ooh, God. That's quite scary. Hello. How are you today? No, that's, that's quite scary. Right, eyes still. Eyes. What's that? Eyebrow. Oh, eyebrow style. There we go. Let's go for a bit of a. Uh, that's like a. Don't a monobrow, do we? That's, that's not cool. <laughs> Let's go for like a, a basic one. Perfect. Ooh. Looks like a scary fella. Right, nose. The nose is so important. How big do we want his nose? That's that is the the big question. Oh, that's quite a nice nose. <laughs> Let's admire his nose. That, that's big nostrils. That will suck you up. Um, go for a slight. Let's go for a slight big nose or a smaller nose. I think small nose looks a little bit odd on the dwarf. I don't know why. Let's go with that one. Nose size. What? It's just changing his hair. Just like, is it? Is it changing his hair? Oh, it is changing. Okay, sorry. I just saw his hair like move on his lips. <laughs> Broken nose? You can break his nose? Ew! It's like a really broken nose. I'm not going to touch that bit. I'm fine. Might make his nose holes a bit bigger. Uh, right there, that's perfect. You have a beautiful nose, young man. Right, mouth shape. What am going to do with mouth shape? Um. Ooh, should I have a bit of teeth off? Right, let's go for that. It's like it likes all semi smiling, wasn't it? Like mouth width, make it a bit, a bit, a little bit bigger perhaps. A big mouth, lip thickness. Oh, it's like Kim Kardashian's dream. Make your lips big for free. Uh, jawline. Uh, I can't see much change to be honest because the beard's there. I can't see any change. I'm just gonna leave that. Jaw size. Oh, it's a slight bit of change. Just the beard sort of covers it up a bit. Bring that in a little bit. Uh, chin size. Double chin. Oh, we could double chin. I can't see chin though, because he's... The hair's in the way. Adam's apple. <laughs> I, can't, I can't see the Adam's apple. It's covered by hair. Okay, just ignore that. It's fine. Right, scars and tattoos. Ooh. So I can have... I've got scars already, haven't I? But I can take them off, perhaps. Scars. Dude, that's quite a cool one. Ooh, I like the one across the eye. Ouch. How intense is the scar? Uh, let's have like a light, slightly less intense one. It's still there, but it's not like a proper uh, cut into the... I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, tattoo designs. Do we want the tattoo on his face? I don't know. I think it looks better without one. We turn them off. We can change the colour of the tattoo as well, though. Which is quite tempting. Um, so that's just one. That's just without. I'm going to go without for now. Right, makeup. Oh, yes. This is why we should go with like a, a female. We could have done some eyeshadow and stuff. Um, yeah, I don't want any eyeliner, lip colour. No, I'm all good. Thank you very much. Right, I have accepted my changes. Chase out his voice. Everything you've heard, completely true. That doesn't, that doesn't sound right, does it? Let's try the other voice quickly. I got two voices. That Everything one. Everything you've heard, completely true. Let's go with that. Says his voice again. As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. That sounds more like his his face and his voice sounds a little bit a little bit like they sort of connect now. All right, accept changes. Oh god, the name. Okay, oh, I'm terrible with names. I'm gonna look on Google.
Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. The Conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead. Except for you. Um, you think I did it? That's horrible. I was to select here. Um, do you think I did it? You think I'm responsible? Explain this. I can't. What do you mean you can't? I don't know what that is or how it got there. You're lying. We need him, Cassandra. So one of these dialogues has like a, an attachment almost. So this one's like a um, let's go to war almost. Or this is I'm just generally confused about life. <laughs> Let me go a bit fierce. Like get me get get me out of here. Bit of a crybaby perhaps as well. Um, let's go with all those people. I can't believe it. All those people dead. Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember running. Things were chasing me, and then a woman. A woman? She reached out to me, but then... <sighs> Go to the Ford Camp Liliana. I will take him to the Rift. What did happen? It will be easier to show you. Oh God. We call it the breach. It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. If I can help, I will. I think that's a noble response. I understand. Then... I'll do what I can, whatever it takes. You sound a bit surprised by that response. Is it, was it a good one? I'm not sure about my character at the moment. I hope we can perhaps change him a little bit. I don't know why. I was sort of not going for like a sexy female character now. They I don't have know why. Uh, what can you they do? need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The Conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. We lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves, as she did. Until the breach is sealed. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach. Look at those little legs. I love it. Little legs, little legs, little legs. I'm quite crap. I think, I, I think the wolf is pretty cool. If I'm honest. Right, I think I'm heading over here now. Let's go. The world actually looks pretty impressive. Open I mean, the gate. It... We are heading into the valley. Thank you. The gate has now been opened. It actually looks really pretty, though, I was going to say. But um, does this run on Xbox One? Um, this is through um, EA Access, so I've got the game for six hours before release. But after that, it's you have to buy the game. Um, this is looking, looking pretty sweet. I'll try to figure out if I went for the right choice or not. I'm not sure, but I don't know. I'm always very incisive with like stuff like that, picking out a class or 
pick in a race, blah, blah, blah. I was like, did I, did I pick the right one? Did I pick the most interesting one? Oh my god, what the hell is this? What is that coming down? That is not a pretty. Whoa, my arm, my arm, my hand. This is hurting me. The pulses are coming faster now. The oh god, my hands. The grows, the more rifts appear, the more demons we face. How did I survive the blast? They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. Whoa! Shit! I didn't expect that! Shit is going down. Jeez, that is just wrecking everyone. Oh no! That, is, that looks. Stay behind me. Do, do I have any weapons yet? There's a weapon there. Um, shield. Ah, there's my weapon. So if it's a shield and a weapon, so that's why well, that's there. This would be something different if you pick different different class or whatever. I'm ready for my first bit of combat. Right trigger. Boom. How do I have to defend? Oh shit! Just press. I can just press right trigger to continuously attack. Okay. Let's go help her out. Oh, look at this. Nice. What's uh, X do? Oh. Oh. Sweet. Stab. Oh, it's got blood as well, apparently. Okay. It's over. Drop your weapon. Now. Um. You need to trust me. I need this weapon. I, we do need this weapon, don't we? Um. You need to trust me. If you're trust going me. to lead me through a demon infested valley, you'll have to trust me. Give me one reason to trust you. I'm a dwarf. Because my life is on the line. <sighs> You're right. I cannot protect you. And I cannot expect you to be defenseless. Whew, she understood. Got my little shitty shield and her shield. God damn it. I should remember you agreed to come willingly. Right, let's continue, right. Take uh, these consume potions. potions. Make her knows what we will face. Left trigger. I've got eight potions, okay. Can I select that? Where are all your soldiers? At the forward camp or fighting. We are on our own for now. Let's get moving. See our next target is just up ahead. Oh, can loot. Let me loot your body. Why are you touching his arsehole? Take all. Let's go. Uh, this game looks really pretty. And I was like, I was so down on this game, and the reviews like just tempted me back into playing it. So I'm not going to commit to like a full series unless you guys keep asking desperately to see more, because it is a long, long game. Uh, but I thought we'd check it out and see um, what it's all about. So, right, abilities consume mana and stamina for powerful combat effects. Most abilities require time to pass, so you have to like replenish the ability. Okay. So an X and Y ability at the moment. If we so flank them, X. we may gain the advantage. Just try and flank them. No, not. Oh, slash both of them. Nice. I can lock onto a target as well. Ooh, awesome. Right, I'm gonna try and try to attack it. Yes. Oh, nice. Slice. Slice. Slice you up. Ah, kill him. That's it. I change my target again. Lock on target. Press my X ability again. Ooh, slash it from behind. Slash. Slash. Die. Dead we his body. There's two down, isn't it? Ice looks really cool. Try to work out what's underneath it. <laughs> Can we loot these bodies or is it just certain bodies? It's just certain bodies. Okay. Let's continue on our journeys. Can we loot you? Can we loot you? Nope. I can see more demons up ahead. Are they called demons? I'm, I'm gonna call them demons. I look on you, bitch. Yo! Up you on see the me hill. yet? Oh shit. It's attacked from a distance. Oh no, okay. Perhaps we got the hill first. I got this way and take this guy out. What is this? Oh, god damn it! You're annoying me. Where's he off to? Oh, he's going down there. Okay, fair enough. Whoa. Oh, nice hit. Slice again. Almost. Oh, he's got like a shield or something? I'm sure that done like 20 or something. Oh, nice. Got a bit of backup. She's a tough, she's a tough chick, which I like. Tough chicks are awesome in games anyway. <laughs> the scary real life. Let's get this up here. Go, go, go. There's a rift. Rift is getting stronger by the second. 
I saw some more stuff drop, so I'm guessing there's some more demons up ahead. I, quite, I think he's quite cool. I like his little legs and stuff when he runs around. They're falling from the breach. Oh, shit. That doesn't sound good. Oh, there's, there's a couple over there. Should we go for them? I mean, we do get XP here, as far as I know, for him to talk like I'm doing a war cry. War cry! That did not help. Slice him up. Come on. Oh. Do the damage. See the little hit points as well. Slash. And smash. You finish him off. And my voice goes. Blah, there we go. Let's come back again. <laughs> I like a sort of semi cold thing. It's not really a proper cold, but it always seems to be there. It's been there for like a couple of weeks. It popped up sometimes out of nowhere. I don't know why this is relevant to anything, but there we go. Slash you from behind, you green peel of some goo. How have you got so much freaking life? I don't think that's not going to work. Oh, I'm weakened. What? Was that, was that me? Attack him. Where is that? My health is that green bar, isn't it? On the, the top. I can tell. Slice! Slice, slice, slice. So get him. Almost got him. Teamwork is a key. So far as I know, you can get like a, up to a party of four. The, the top amount of like party you can have that so you you gain people in the way you can select who's in your party and you can sort of continue your adventure that way but this game is going to be a long game <laughs> be a very long game i'm you intrigued fighting. Who's fighting? you'll see soon we must help them oh god okay what's over here can I, should i check over here quickly for loot and stuff we like we smash these barrels no you can't smash barrels this game is crap and no, i'm joking <laughs> I don't like this game, it's terrible. Oh god, what the hell is that thing? How the hell can I attack it? I'm gonna help out as much as I can. Lock on target. Yes. Oh, slicey, slicey, slicey. I'll just slice him. Oh, look at that. Yes. Sliced him, almost leveled up, which is good. Well, not really, remote, almost, but not. I think like, that's leveled up the first time. Oh, what's that? I've seen you in the cutscene, the trailers and stuff. Oh, can I like pull it back? Am I like doing some good here? What did you do? I closed it. I did nothing. The credit is yours. Is that an elf? Is it like a dark elf or just a normal elf? So, can I help? At least this is good for something. Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. Interesting. And it seems I was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself. Possibly. It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Good to know. Here I thought we'd be ass deep in demons forever. Barak Tethras. Rogue, storyteller, and occasionally unwelcome tag along. <laughs> what was that wink for? Um, so he's another another door who looks a lot better than mine. If I'm honest, it looks a lot cooler, so I'm a little bit jealous. But there we go. Uh, pleased to meet you. Nice crossbow. What's now? Uh, nice crossbow. That's a nice crossbow. You have Can there. I have it? Ah, isn't she? Bianca and I have been through a lot together. Who? You Bianca. named your crossbow Bianca. Bianca. Of course. And she'll be great company in the valley. <laughs> Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. He means I kept that mark from killing you while you slept. Oh, well, thank you. Then I owe you my thanks. Thank me if we manage to close the breach without killing you in the process. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I have seen. Your prisoner is no mage. Indeed, I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. We must get to the forward camp quickly. Well... Bianca's excited. I'm sure she is. So now we've got the companions of four. So I was talking about only having four companions, and now we've got four. This way, Yay! down the bank. The road ahead uh, blocked. We oh, must this way. move quickly. Can we jump over this? Oh, we can jump. Wee! Oh my god. That was cool seeing the wolf do that. Wee! -hee! I guess he jumps pretty 
He jumps his height. Jeez, that's got springy legs. Right, so I can control. Oh, yes. Oh my god. Right, I'm sold. I'm going to. I'm using the sexy lady. <laughs> Cassandra is mine. That shield is freaking awesome. I love the shield. Oh, Demon's shit. Head. Glad okay. you brought me now, Seeker. Yes, I'm really pleased. I could do. Ah, okay, this is that tactical mode. Right, I'm going to tell him to attack this. Solos to attack this guy. Attack that. I'm sure, there's other things you can do. Um, you can move to like there, then go for that guy. You get the point. I'm gonna tell him to go around the back here and take this guy out and exit. I mean, it's not always necessarily like essential, but oh, she's a bit a little, a little bit of trouble. What's she got? This like shield ability thing. Attack. Oh, nice. Slice and dice your face. What's this B1 do? Ooh, that's pretty awesome. Right, how are we doing for life, guys? Too bad. Where's the enemies? I'm just attacking nothing. Right, there we go. It's like a little mini boss guy, but I feel out of help. Yes, yeah, slap him. Just hit him with his shield. Beastly. I like it. Right, now where? Let's head up here. Right, where should we be? Uh, let's be... Oh, I want to be you. The other the wolf we've got. What, did, did something come up there? I thought someone spawned so, there, but... Are you innocent? I don't remember what happened. The How convenient. Every time. Should have spun a story. That's what you would have done. <laughs> it's more believable and less prone to result in premature execution. Oh, look at this. Crossbow. Range attacks. I think it's got a What the hell? is taking a lot of hits. Do the X. Whatever that does. Ooh. That done a lot of damage. What is that? Oh, like a little trap thing. Very nice. I'm gonna switch up. Go for a bit of a magey gloriness. So these two are more like ranged units. So I'm glad I went for like um, still shield guy. Makes sense. Shield and hand weapon stuff. What are you doing over there? That, that's taking a frame of damage off. I was just doing. Oh, shield and frozen. He's little legs that he can't move. Oh, poor guy. Oh, you see my footsteps. There you go. It's all slowly disappear. There you go. There you do the slowly disappear. Let's go to Cassandra. Cassandra! What was this? I love the detail in this game, though. It looks really good. It's like the scenery and like the details and the the voice looks the, the sort of um, when it goes to like, the cutscene looks good as well. Oh, icicles! They are. If you you do not want to be standing underneath these things, they look painful. Another so rip. painful. We oh shit! Okay, let's seal it. Well, it's only one person can see it, as far as I know. And that's he's our guy. Slash! Oh, look at that! Just slap him up. All right, at least someone's going to take out the guy at the back. I should have gone into a command mode, or it's called. Slash! All right, let's switch up again. Uh, there we go. I need to try and close this. Where is he? Hurry. There he is. <laughs> right, Hughes, go. Yes, we can close this rift. Done it. I'll hold it for some at a time. Done. Well done. Level up as well. Yes. Your character's leveled up. This increases health and stats automatically and a wall's ability points. Awesome. Okay. So let's jump into this. Let's go for a bit of, um, perhaps a bit of battle master. So this does. So damage. 100% weapon damage for 12 seconds and uh, uh, costs 20 stamina. Okay. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Is that a good one to go with? Let's go with that. Can we go with that? Select. We have done. Apply. Sweet. That's one of our points gone. Do we have any more for the other guys? That makes any sense. So this is all the abilities we have. We can also interchange between all the other characters so we can select their abilities, which is pretty awesome. Uh, for now, we'll have a quick look at these babies. Uh, Payback Strike does 20% damage, weapon damage. Five seconds needs a cooldown of eight seconds. And how much stamina does that use? 35. That's a lot of stamina. Ouch. Okay. Um, Warcry. So, this is a, uh, guard, guard provides protection from incoming attacks by granting additional health. Okay. Interesting. Um, duration four seconds. Guard per enemy 200%. Cooldown 24 seconds. But it does waste 35 stamina. Ouch. 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 Do we do like attributes and stuff, or is that something that 
I don't think we do. Does it just go up automatically? I'm not sure to be honest. I'll have a look into that. But yeah, that's all his stats at the moment. Lady Cassandra, we are clear for the moment. Well done. Whatever that thing on your hand is, it's useful. I guess it is useful. Um, so we're doing now though is end this episode here. Hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see some more of this game, hit the thumbs up button. Let me know in the comments below. Sorry it's a little bit noob. I'm still learning all the stuff obviously as we go. This is only part number one. So I appreciate that. But I'll see you guys later. And bye-bye.